Welcome to my channel. This is Muli. So today this we'll be looking at chemistry for grade 12, 50, 70, paper 2, that is 2020 question A4. Then I've skipped second set se setting questions because uh they are quite simple. They're straightforward. So I'll base my explanation on more concept. So the question was uh, saying that uh, you need to do what? Calculate the mass, which was what? In excess. So this was a data which was in the question. I just I've just summarized. They gave the mass of what? Magnesium, and also the volume and the concentration of the acid. So when you add this and that, those are the results. So how do you go about? So each time you are given the con the volume and the concentration. From here, you are able to do what? Come up with the what? Um, the number of moles. The way it is chemistry or more concept, we don't use masses in finding whatever we are looking for. No. We always use what? Number of moles. Then from there, once you know the number of moles of the other one, then we use more ratios to find the other moles for compounds or elements which are not known. You need to uh, mark that one. So like for instance, this one. The question here they are asking us to find the mass of what magnesium but in the data they have given us the volume and the concentration for the acid so meaning that let's find first of all the number of moles of that so using this formula here we can come up we can we can we were able to what to have our number of moles here when you do the cross multiplication the formula the, the formula will be like that uh then you replace then on the volume, since uh, the volume it is in centimeter cubed, you just divide with 1000 centimeter, then you close, then you say 1 decimeter, then you have converted into decimals, uh, uh, decimeter cubed. So you find that that will cancel out with this one. Then the centimeters also, they also cancel out with this one. Then you just remain with what? Number of moles. So those are the moles for what? So the, uh, I mean, what's this? I, uh, let's see, let's see, uh, so now here we come and see the more ratios now to find uh, the number of moles for the other one which we are looking for which is magnesium. So magnesium here uh, is, has, is having one but this one two meaning that the number of moles for the, uh, magnesium they are twice the number of moles for hydrochloric acid or the number of moles for hydrochloric acid are half the number of moles of what? Uh, magnesium when you look at uh, the more ratios here. No wonder here you are seeing that this is what I did. So number of moles for magnesium, I just half of the number of moles of what? Uh, hydrochloric acid. Then from there, we're able to have what? Our moles now. Then from the moles, once you have the moles, now that's when you can find what you're looking for. So we use this formula. Number of moles is equal to mass over molar mass. This one is one which will help us to do what? To find the mass of magnesium. So the mass of magnesium here, when you do over one, you do your cross multiplication. Then you have your mass that side, then the number of moles multiply with the molar mass. Then there, you just replace your molar mass there, it is 24 uh, grams per mole. Then the mole will cancel out with the mole, then here you mean with what? The grams only. So this is how you get your, uh, what is your answer. Now you are not done. Have you seen that your mass is even at least less than what was given in the question? So you just subtract the two, then you just have that. So this was in excess not every mass was used that wasn't used that's why how you go about then the other question they are saying that you calculate the volume of uh hydrogen that could be produced at what rtp so at rtp you need to know that one more is equivalent to what 24 decimeter cubed then here you do the same also you use you need to find the number of moles so the number of moles which we know is for what hydrochloric so here we used to we will find the what is the more ratio also so here it is one also then there it is two just like magnesium it was so it is half the number of moles of what hydrochloric this is what i did here then after i found my moles then i will just say one more i know that it is what that 24 decimeter cubed then what about that is equals to x then i just do close multiplication then from there it gave me what after doing all the calculations as you can see here it just gave me that if you want you can multiply this by what a thousand if you want to have what your volume in centimeter centimeter what? or centimeter cubed if you want but if you want you can just leave it the way it is they'll still mark you wrong eh, correct <laughs> sorry 